Hi there, welcome to our series of MG Alpha Scots Trad Music Award Sponsor Chats. Today we are speaking to the Trad Album of the Year sponsor, Burnham CD. Hi Martin, how's it going? I'm fine, Simon, how are you? Oh, very good, thanks. So tell us about Burnham CD. Who are you and what do you do? Well, we're basically a sort of music services company. Um, I started it, we started 36 years ago. Uh, back in 1986 as Burnham Tapes and at that point we offered the the first sort of real-time cassette duplication facility in Scotland. At that time the, the minimum cassettes you could get done were a thousand because they were all factory factory made um, and we, we introduced this real-time facility where you could quite easily run off 50 or 100 or 500 or a thousand whatever people wanted. So it was a good thing for um, it was a good opportunity for bands and artists to be able to run smaller numbers for demos or for promotional purposes or to sell at gigs. Um, and we started off, the first one we ever did was for Black Eyed Biddy, their Good Neighbours album. And then we continued, like, we continued with that until into this century, actually. <laughs> and, uh, and then at that point, we changed the name to Burnham Cassette Duplication, which we then were able to shorten to Burnham CD when cassettes finally died out. And ever since then, we've been, oh, we just keep up with whatever's going. We do CD pressing, we do vinyl pressing, uh, DVDs, um, streaming and downloads. We can facilitate that. We do bits of PR. We sell CDs online through our own shop and through Amazon and other outlets. And basically, it's, just, it's a range of it's a range of sort of label services that independent musicians can access, you know, so they can continue with making the music and don't have to worry about all the sort of things that a record label in the old days used to take care of. Now, you, you obviously, you work for musicians, but do you work for with other companies or organisations as well? I mean, we work with some record labels. Um, we, we work with a few sort of, you know, local councils, government organisations. We've done we've done quite a few jobs over the years for Creative Scotland, promotional albums to go to the likes of Womex or um, the South by Southwest Festival, for example. We've produced CDs for cover mount, cover mounts on with the, uh, the Sunday Herald and Rock and, uh, Rock and Reel magazine and others like that. So, we we'll work with we we'll work with all kinds of people. We we'll work with people all over the place as well, over Europe, not not just throughout Scotland and the UK, but all around Europe, uh, across North America. And just the other week, we we delivered our first ever order to Lebanon. Pretty amazing, oh. multicultural. <laughs> Absolutely, see us, see culture. <laughs> so, do you do you press everything in the UK? No, we pretty well press nothing in the UK. Um, there's there's no CD pressing plants in the UK. Well, there are actually, but they're quite small and quite expensive, to be honest. We have better deals, and this goes back to way before Brexit, which is another story, but um, we've always worked with, with pressing plants all across Europe, different countries in Europe. Uh, we've even, out with that, we've worked with present plants in Taiwan out in the Far East in the, in the past. And nowadays we use a pressing plant in the Netherlands for most of our CDs. Uh, they're great people. We've been out there to see them a few times and we get on very well with them. And for vinyl, we have uh, there's a plant in the Czech Republic who we mostly use. So everything gets pressed in Europe and uh, we ship it into the UK or wherever it needs to go because we do have... We do have uh, clients all over the place as I said. And are, are there any highlights looking forward to 2023 for Burnham CD? Well it's our 37th year so it's you know I suppose it gets us a year nearer our 40th year. <laughs> <laughs> no huge highlight. I mean I, I don't have any there's no big idea that I'm particularly looking looking for next year. I mean I've, I've been in discussion brief discussion with with a few other people about the idea of sort of pooling resources to maybe maybe see what we can offer to 
in terms of distributions or opportunities and uh, other things like that. I mean, we've we've gone out to, you know, we're members of a couple of trade organisations. We've been out to Womex. Uh, before the pandemic, we were out there three years in a row and, and made some great contacts with, with uh, other record labels, distributors and our, uh, media people all over all over the world, really. Um, so when we get back to that again next year, which would be a, a great thing to do, it's in Spain mm. next year. Warm. Oh, yeah, it's a bit <laughs> in Galicia that time of year. So we'd like to do that, but otherwise we're you know we're developing what we're doing. We're we're continuing. We're busy as we've ever been, pretty well. Um, you know, despite the the continuing tales of doom and gloom about, about CDs, people are still getting us to make them and we'll still be selling them. Either that or the wardrobes of Scotland are all full of boxes <laughs> of our CDs, I don't know. Well, anyway, the most important question, I suppose, of all, as one of the MG Alapa Scots Tribe Music Awards, all the sponsors, how are you going to be celebrating being part of the 20th MG Alapa Scots Tribe Music Awards? Well, I'm going to turn up this year, which is the first time for three years, I think. The last time I was there was was at Aberdeen in 2019. Um, I've avoided the last couple of years because of the, the pandemic, obviously, at my age, and I've got a heart condition, which, which means I just sort of was being a bit more careful than I've, uh, than I've been the rest of my life <laughs> up to that point. And, um, so I'll, it'll be great to be back at the at the trads and, and 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 catch up with people who I haven't seen for a couple of years or I've just seen on this wee screen like yourself here. Um, that'll be grand because it was it's you know the trads, the event itself is a is a great get together. It's like it's like the it's like the Scottish music scene, the trad scenes, Hogmanay. But you know we're all getting together and you meet and with a lot of people you haven't seen for a lot of time, make some new connections and uh, catch up with a lot of folk. And I'm really looking forward to to doing that. Well, fantastic. Well, thanks again for your support. Find out about Burnham CD at burnhamcd.com. You can see it on your screen there. And if anyone wants to come to the MG Alapa Scots Trad Music Awards, go to scotstradmusicawards.com. It'll be an amazing night. Thanks very much, Martin. Okay, see you there.